Hey, how are you? Ooh, guess your interview went all right. Oh, I'm glad to hear that. You were quite nervous about it, weren't you? Yeah, just same old, you know, nothing special. Um, finished work at six and had dinner. Did you have something for dinner? What you have? Yeah, I did, but I'm getting over snackish. Do you want to get something to need one? Okay, let's go then. A few moments later. Cheers. I don't drink much, obviously, but if I do, gin and tonic, classic. And if you're talking beer, um, I quite like dark beer like Guinness, but it has to be draft. And in Korea, um, plum wine, yeah. Really? No, I haven't. Wow, okay. I thought it was cancelled. Oh, I'm glad to hear that though, because it's much better than completely cancelling it. You know, they were really excited about it. Eugene. So um, her wedding was meant to be this August but you know it's quite hard to keep the schedule as it was before so I think they're making some changes now but yeah um, I don't think they're cancelling it but they're just postponing it to a couple months later I'm more of a, I'd say I'm more of a spontaneous one because I'm not really good at making like a set plan and sticking to it and but I've been trying to, I've been trying to make plans in advance I just started actually but it's really hard to do that because it's not something that I've been doing for a long time um, but I really want to get it as a habit um, because it gives you that drive to get things done but yeah, it's really hard How about you? That's so true. It's so hard to be spontaneous as you get busy with your jobs and stuff. Um, especially making plans with your friends because everyone has their own schedule as well. Do you know what I've been doing? I'm very forgetful. I'm like a goldfish. <laughs> so I need to um, put everything, like I need to remind myself to do something or that I have plans with my friends on that day. So I've been trying to put everything in my calendar you know they send like a notification for you to remember everything and it's really helpful actually so i've been trying to do that <sighs> i'm 
night person. Definitely a night person. Um, this one as well, I want to be a morning person. But you know, it's just hard to change um, your day and night. Because if you are a morning person, you get so many things done and it's like lunchtime or something like that. And you have the whole day waiting for you. It's so nice. And if you're a night person, lunchtime is like your morning. So you get something done and it's like night already. Which is your time. Like it's the time, night is the time that we get productive. But then, I don't know, there's something about being a morning person that empowers you. Like literally, it, it gives you something. It gives you that energy to do something. And you get, I think you get to use your time much more wisely. So yeah, I wish I could change it. I mean, I sleep at like three or four in the morning and I wake up after like six, six hours or so. So yeah, I mean, I might try it today actually. <laughs> How about you? Very soon actually, so I need to get to work really early today. I have a morning appointment tomorrow. Just a night checkup, nothing serious, but you know it's been a while since I did my last one, so taking boss on. Okay, I'll walk you to the bus stop then. That's fine, it's like right right there, so I'll just walk you there. Okay, let's go. 